have a quorum, so we'll get down to business. Thanks, sir. There's been studies that show between 78 and 86 percent of law enforcement agencies in Florida are struggling right now with retention and recruitment. So anything we can do to assist with retention and recruitment will greatly help the officers in the state of Florida that provide the public safety day in and day out to the residents of Florida. We want them here in Florida. We want them to stay. And by staying, we want them to buy houses. We want them to be in our communities and we want to lift them up. 15 yay, zero nay. Members by your vote. Please show the uh, bill reported favorably. Recognized to explain House Bill 3. to just know what I wanted to do from a young age to where I am now is just nothing but a blessing and it's definitely helped me shape my career and my future and I'm just ready to serve my community and keep going on. Members, let's show the Florida law enforcement officers that we respect them, we support them, and we appreciate them. It gives hope to those that are looking for a career in law enforcement but are weighing the risk versus the benefits of service to the citizens of this state. To step into the breach, to sacrifice for the greater good is the noblest of callings. Our law enforcement officers and our military face very real risks that those of us who work behind desks cannot imagine. These men and women deserve our understanding. They deserve our gratitude and they deserve our respect.